Hi guys, welcome to Simply Scuba. Here we have the Aqualung Rogue BCD. Uh, so this is much like the Outlaw, if you know the Outlaw BCD, in that all the different parts of it, it doesn't come fully assembled, it comes in the four different parts, and you can choose different sizes depending on your body shape. So no longer is it a matter of small, medium, or large. You get small shoulder straps, a medium uh, sort of back plate, and a large waistband if you want, or you can mix and match, depending on your body shape. Um, so it's fantastic. It means that you can get a real like custom BCD for your body shape, but let's take a closer look. So starting up over the left hand shoulder, you have your corrugated inflator hose. So that's held in position by a, uh, a little clip on there and a strap around that. Uh, moving down to the inflator, gray button inflates and then the, uh, the black button on the tip deflates. You've got the oral inflation valve as well. And if you grab hold of that and pull that down over your shoulder, there's a cable inside of that that's gonna open up a dump valve over your shoulder. So that's a real quick way to, uh, to dump uh, some gas if you're upright. Underneath that, the shoulder straps. So now we have pre-bent metal D-rings on this. So uh, pre-bent just makes it a little bit easier for you to, uh, to clip off and onto it. It's not gonna sit completely flat. Uh, stainless steel, very, very tough. Underneath that, nice uh, sort of mesh padding. It's nice and light, but it's also soft as well. Because this is designed primarily as a traveling jacket, uh, if you're not wearing a, a thick wetsuit or if you're just wearing a rash vest, you don't want anything too tough or coarse. So it's nicely rounded, so it's nice and soft against your skin. Across your chest, you have a one-way adjustable pinch clip. Uh, so the chest strap just stops those shoulder straps from separating and pulling over your shoulders. Uh, over your right hand shoulder, you do have a pull dump. Uh, I'll show you how that uh, attaches to the bladder a little bit because you can disassemble this completely, pack it in different bits. You can replace certain parts. If you rip or uh, sort of break a certain part, you can just replace it. You don't have to replace the entire BCD. Um, above that, you've got some daisy chains so you can clip off onto that. You've got another stainless steel D-ring. And then moving down, we have these hinged pinch clips. So um, they're hinged, so they're nice and ergonomic. So that shoulder strap can uh, come in from whatever angle is comfortable and it naturally sits in that comfortable angle. Pushing in on this circle is gonna undo that strap. Uh, so very quick and easy to, uh, to get in and out of the BC. Moving down, the back plate has got a nice amount of padding on this. Uh, so again, if you're not wearing a thick, chunky wetsuit, you've got your cylinder on your back, you're not gonna feel that pressure because it's nice and padded. You've got the mesh as well, so that's gonna drain really quick and dry between dives. Moving down to the waistband. So on your left-hand side, you've got knife grommets on this uh, little pocket. Right now, it's nice and neat and tidy, but if you undo this, you have a drop-down pocket. So the Velcro pockets, uh, it bellows out so you've got plenty of space for a spare mask or a reel or a DSMB, whatever you need. And you still have that Velcro closure and the knife grommets as well. So it keeps your knife uh, sort of close to hand. A uh, little plastic D-ring, that's to adjust that uh, waistband, uh, keep it nice and tight. Moving over to the right hand side, you have a little octo sleeve. So instead of having to clip an octo clip on uh, or a little pocket built in, you have this little sleeve. So bend that octo hose and push it into there, keeps it on your hip, quick release as well. Uh, and you don't need any additional clips. Same as the, um, the left hand side, you've got a drop down Velcro pocket, bellows open. So you do have plenty of storage space uh, on this little BCD. Moving underneath there, we've got a little stainless steel D-ring just down on your hip. You've got some more daisy chain webbing on there. And if we move around inside uh, the BCD, this is where you can attach some integrated weights if you want to. Um, you can sort of clip them onto there. Uh, just gives you a bit of either trim or, uh, or quick release uh, weights. Whilst we're on the side of the bladder, you can see we've got some webbing straps and these are elasticated. So as you deflate the BCD, they naturally sort of contract and pull that wing in, so it's nice and streamlined, it's not gonna be flapping around, holds it nice and close uh, to your body. Tough bladder on this, um, so you don't have to worry about um, too much abrasion. Uh, up here is where your, uh, your low pressure dump valve over your right hand shoulder attaches. So there's a little bayonet fitting on there, nice and secure, and that just means that you can detach the bladder and swap it out uh, or swap those shoulder straps out. 
Over to the left hand shoulder, this is your pull dump 90 degree angle for your, um, for your main inflator. Moving down, we've got a little grab handle um, that fits through the bladder. Moving down, we've got their cinch strap. So the cinch strap is a clever invention. Instead of the uh, convoluted threading of a traditional cam band, um, we have a two part metal buckle. So you can wrap that around your cylinder, just hook that onto there and then um, to sort of clamp it down. First of all, we have a finger saver, so it doesn't clamp down all the way, just in case your finger or a bit of your hand is in there, it pauses for a little bit, make sure that your hand is clear, and then you can clamp it down. So very quick and easy to adjust, especially if you're changing from big cylinders down to a 12, uh, or just adjusting cylinder size in general. Down at the bottom, on your right hand side, on your right hand kidney, we have a kidney dump. Again, nice and low profile, so it's not gonna get caught or snagged. Very low profile, single um, pull dump, but that also acts as an overpressure valve. So all in all, a fantastic uh, travel set. It's a little bit tougher than the Outlaw. It's got a few more little um, sort of features sort of dialed up on it. This is the Aqualung Rogue BCD. Thanks for watching, safe diving. <laughs>